One is through the research collaboration, whether they're a graduate student or undergraduate has a chance to get exposed to research, they're going to get excited about this. Uh, space is exciting. There's a reason that we're all smiles today. That's University of Texas President Jay Hartzell, Hartzell talking about the UT system's partnership with U.S. Space Force, space branch of the military, teaming up with UT Austin and the University of Texas El Paso to advance research and training in space. Two colleges, just two of the 11 chosen to the new Space Forces University Partnership Program. UTEP President Dr. Health Heather Wilson joins us this morning to talk about what this means for students. Morning, Doctor. Thanks for being with us. Good morning. It's great to be with you. It's got to be such a great opportunity for your university and for the entire uh, UT system to be able to participate in this in this way. It is. It's a wonderful opportunity. And you're right, there are only 11 universities nationwide that are part of this initial partnership program, and two of them are in the U University of Texas system. We're just learning if we know anything really at all about what Space Force is and what will be, but what have you heard about what the department will be looking for from your students? What, what will this program at the universities look like? Well, they're looking for both research and talent. The Space Force is still part of the Department of the Air Force. It's the smallest military service, but it operates satellites for national security purposes and is responsible for defending them and deterring any attack on our satellites in space. And so, so our responsibility as universities will be to, to work with the Space Force on advancing research and knowledge, but also developing the next generation of people who understand how to operate in space. And more and more things are enabled by space in our economy, and it's, it's vital to the country. It's got to be so exciting in terms of space exploration, defense, uh, new technology. You know, the, they're going to be working on things that don't even exist yet. <laughs> the students that come through are, are, are developing things of their own. That's got to be so uh, exciting and challenging to put a program and a department together to meet those needs. It is. Now, UTEP has been involved in space research for decades. Of course, we're right next to White Sands Missile Range, which was the proving ground after the end of World War II. Um, we've also, uh, we also have both Virgin Galactic and Blue Origin right next to us. In fact, three quarters of the engineers out at the site in Van Horn are actually UTEP graduates. So, so we have a Bachelor of Science in Aerospace now. We're putting in a 70, new $70 million research facility here in El Paso for advanced manufacturing and aerospace. So there's a lot going on in West Texas when it comes to space. <laughs> it is pretty cool to see. And, and when we've watched the launches and things, I mean, uh, like you said, they're, they're just showing up right in your backyard there as, as the work starts to really begin um, in earnest. Uh, and we know that math and science has been so important anyway, even before all these new developments. But if, if prospective students or up and coming students would like to learn more about some of these programs, uh, where can they go get a little more information? Well, the most, most important thing to do is to you know, contact UTEP or contact UT Austin or their local university. For us in West Texas, most, most of our, our best students in the region come to UTEP, um, and we have a lot of students who are engaged and, and inspired by this opportunity to be the, be the next generation to take us back to the moon and beyond. That's right, and, and do so many other things, like I said, things that we don't even know are possible yet. We'll certainly be watching in the years and decades to come as all this gets underway. Dr. Heather Wilson from the University of Texas, El Paso, thank you so much for your time. We appreciate it. Great to be with you.